Zebra Herd, welcome back to Super Smash Brothers Ultimate. Today we're moving back into classic mode and trying out yet another character, but before we do, I do wanna let you know that I'm trying the GameCube controller today. Now, I'm not very experienced with the GameCube controller, but I figured I'd give it a shot since a lot of people seem to be very passionate about it. I don't know if it's really just better for people who grew up with it, but I'll try it out and see if I like it and I'll let you guys know about it as we go throughout today's episode. Beyond that, while I was testing out the GameCube controller to see if it would work, uh, I accidentally like started the game and it said that I unlocked the L Nintendo Labo costume for the Mii Fighter. I don't know if that's incredibly important or not, but I figured I'd keep you guys up to date with the progress we're making and it looks like, is there any news? I don't know, it, it was red over there, so I don't know. Anyways, we're just gonna go into games and more and I'll talk about which character we're showcasing today. I do wanna go into practice mode to show his moves or maybe I could do that in a battle, I don't really know. But we're gonna be doing Donkey Kong. He is the second fighter and let's hope that we do well. Uh, he seems to be like sort of like a heavier set character, which might be a bit difficult for me. Usually when I play these kind of games, I try to play characters that are like light and dexterous. So last episode, or the last time we did classic mode, we started on 0.0. I'm gonna just continue to sort of slightly tweak the difficulty. So for right now, we'll do 1.0 and see how well we do and hope that everything turns out okay. But yeah, if you guys have the GameCube controller, let me know your thoughts on it. And oh man, you know what? I forgot to showcase the different skins for DK. We'll have to do that at the end of today's episode. But before we do too much more against Diddy Kong, let's take a look at his move list. So he has the B button, which is Giant Punch. Charges up a punch that can keep charging after dodging or shielding. Uh, his move and B is Headbutt. Buries opponents when they're hit on the ground. Can't be interrupted by weaker attacks, which is awesome. Up in B is the Spinning Kong. Spins with a whirlwind of punches. Can shift left or right while airborne and forward while grounded. And then down in B is Hand Slap, which is uh, sends out shockwaves by slapping the ground, sending foes into the air. Has a meteor effect while airborne, which is pretty cool. So that's sort of like a Donkey Kong Country Returns. And then B is Final Smash Jungle Rush. Uh, Donkey Kong pummels opponents with a flurry of punches before launching them with a finishing uppercut. If the first hit doesn't make contact, the whole attack fails. So make sure you get that hit in. So that's pretty cool. And then there is a list. Oh, look at this, okay. So I guess we can just sort of choose from here. I was hoping it'd have different in, like, information about the, the moves that you can get with the A button, but I guess you just don't have to figure those ones out on your own. But yeah, that's pretty cool. I like this one. <laughs> that's my favorite. Oh man, that is so cool. So he carries like a lot of weight with him, which is really fun. And a lot of you let me know that I should be very careful about using my up special, which is what the B button is special. Ooh, oh he had a shield, but he put it on the wrong way. Um, that I should be very careful when using my up special because I only get one use of it. So if I end up using it when I'm at like a free fall, that could be a bit of an issue. Or oh, let's get a Pokeball. Well, oh no, the Pokemon, I threw it off. I'm sorry, Donkey Kong's not a very good trainer. Okay, you know what? Let's try charging. Ah, oh, that's so cool. Wait, wait, how do I, oh my gosh, that is so cool. Sorry, Diddy. <laughs> All right, we got the clear. So of course, Donkey Kong is one of the classic Super Smash Bros characters. Uh, he was in the 64 version. And of course, he has a lot of history along with Mario. He was in the first Mario game, or at least the first game that Mario was featured in, which was Donkey Kong. And hey, look, we're going against King K. Rool. And do we have, wait, is Diddy Kong helping us or hurting us? I have no clue. It looks like he's helping us. Yeah, he's the same color as we are. How cool is that? <laughs> All right, come on, keep going, keep going. Boom. Okay, so we're definitely bringing it to uh, K. Rule right now. I like it. Let's go ahead and do this since I'm pretty safe around here. Oh, I love this uh, this arena, this map. It's pretty cool. Okay, oh, he was about to fall into the barrel. He recovers really well. Oh, what is this? Whoa! Whoa, that's a Star Fox thing. Uh, okay, where'd he go? Whoa, did we beat him? Oh, that was it, okay, cool. <laughs> Awesome, so DK won with Diddy that time against King K. Rool. Of course, K. Rool is the main bad guy of some of the Donkey Kong games. Not all of them, but most of them. Okay, so we're doing pretty well so far. I like it. But yeah, Donkey Kong has been in a number of different games. The original Donkey Kong series on the NES and the arcades, and then of course, Donkey Kong Country. Whoa, look at this Pilot Wings map. I think this is what this is. Going against uh, Captain Falcon and Wario. Don't know what the relation is between these guys, but uh, sure. Okay, ooh. Oh yeah, that's right, we can like knock you guys into the floor. Oh man, there's so many different moves you can do, it's pretty crazy. Go ahead and grab it like that. Oh, ooh, that was good, that was good. Oh, give me this, give me this. 
Boom. <laughs> Seeing Donkey Kong with like a little blaster is hilarious. Come on, get rid of him. Oh, that's it, maybe. So apparently I can even throw, wow, that was good. I can even throw items at people and that can hurt them. You guys let me know about that. Thank you guys so much for all of your tips you've been leaving me. It's been super helpful to figure some things out that way. All right, it's a nice play, I like that. 64,000 points in total right now. We're storming through this. Journey to New Dong City. Oh, is that what it is? I saw that on the top there. That is so cool. Whoa, we all look huge on this map. <laughs> so we're going against Ness and Lucas, ow, which of course uh, are both uh, from the Mother series, so they get to be in the Mother map. Okay, there we go. Ow, ow, ow. You know what, get out of here. Oh, that is such a cool move. Like, how do you even defend against that? Also, I wanna try doing the grab move. There it is. Nice, we just like spiked him like a volleyball. <laughs> sort of feel bad about that one. So I like that, how he can like spin into enemies. Come on, come on. Oh, I messed it up a little bit. Ow, now he grabbed me. Get out of here. I like how Diddy Kong teams up with the mo for with us for the most part. Oh, you know what? Can you get back over here? Thank you. Not quite taken out though. Oh. Almost got him. Oh, come on. Get over here, see what happens. Oh, that didn't really work too well. But I can sort of roll and dodge, which is pretty cool. Oh, Donkey Kong with a barrel, surprise, surprise. Ow, I hit myself with it, no. <laughs> I'm sorry, oh gosh, no wait, that was a Kuko. That was a Kuko, no, this has gone really bad really fast. Okay, come on, come on, I gotta be able to get him. Gotta be able to get him, because he's about to get me. Where'd he go, he's over here. Grab this thing. No, ow, the, the cars are hitting me. Get out of here, Lucas. How are you surviving this long? Get out of here, wowie. Jeez Louise. All right, we're successful again. My gosh. So it looks like that was not as many points that time. I think the better you do, the higher it goes up. Oh, we're going against the Inkling, still journeying to New Dong City. I like how every classic mode has a story. A lot of you let me know that the ending of classic mode this time is not Master Hand. It was in previous Smash games, but not this one. All right, this is, I've never seen this map before, and I don't know if we've even gone against an Inkling. Oh, we're covered in blue ink. So are they competing against each other as well since they're two different colors? I don't think so. I think they combine their powers to be successful at Smash. So they can go back to Splatoon, and then they can battle there. Okay, you know what? There we go, that was good. I like it. Oh, that was cool. Oh, that is so cool. Doing down and A at the same time makes for a pretty cool move. There's so like the, the moves are all very nuanced for every character. Every character has like a huge different selection of moves, which is awesome. All right, now we're going against Mario and Luigi. How classic. And we're at the top of New Dog City, we made it. Okay, cool, oh gosh, already throwing fireballs at me. Is Luigi a clone of Mario? They both throw a fireball. I don't know if that's sort of a thing. I guess we'll find out when we play Luigi. Um, a lot of people have been asking. I do plan on playing all the characters in order when it comes to classic mode, just because I'm such a newcomer to Smash myself. So I wanted to be able to explore it, you know, as easily as possible. And that way, oh gosh, which Pokemon did we get? We got this guy. Oh, Smash Ball! Smash Ball! Give it to me! Smash Ball! Yes! Wait, no! 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 What happened? I got my Smash. And then it went away. Ah, oh, sad music. Dang, let's spend 50 coins. That stinks! Wait, wait, I'm back. Oh, but I don't get my Smash Ball. I didn't know it was gonna start me in the middle of the battle. I thought it was gonna start the battle over, like in story mode. Weird. Ah, oh, I'm so disappointed about that. Oh, wow. Oh, you know what? Mm, that was a dumb idea. But now I can slam down on you. <laughs> that was actually pretty cool. Whoa, 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 wait, wait, where are the platforms? They sort of moved around while I was up there. But of course, New Dong City from, uh... Oh, we got him? We got him from Super Mario Odyssey. How fun was that? But yeah, my favorite Donkey Kong game has to be probably the original Donkey Kong Country. There's so many good DK games at this point. We played Tropical Freeze earlier this year when it released on the Switch. That was a ton of fun. I hadn't played that before, so that was like a full 100% playthrough. Bonus game! Oh, gosh. So we totally failed at this before. I think it's the same one though, unfortunately. It would be cool if there was a different one for every character or like a random thing every time. But unfortunately, that's not the case. Even though I feel like we have a good chance of doing well with this with DK. There we go, ooh. I don't think these things always have stuff in them. Whoa, no wait, no wait! Ah, oh, that's why I shouldn't use my up special. Oh well. But yeah, Donkey Kong's a very heavy character and I feel like that's something I'm not gonna be very good with. 
Okay, journey to the New Dog City final round. Actually, no, we're going against Master Hand. Maybe I was wrong. Maybe some final battles are Master Hand, but not all of them. That could be the idea. Okay. Okay, so we're going against Master Hand, though, at the top of New Dong City. Leave it alone. This city's named after us. You better bet we're going to protect it. Oh, I see the uh, the Odyssey in the background. Okay, hold on. Ow, that hurt. No, 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 no. Ooh. Go ahead and smack him like that. Didn't really do too much damage, did it? Ooh. Ooh, I hit him. <laughs> Punch in the hand. Okay, do what we can. Do what we can. I just got to block when he does attacks like this. Well, this actually... Okay, it does block. Oh, cool. But it still made us dizzy. That's not good. Okay. Come on, come on. Keep beating him up, Dizzy. I, I'm dizzy, so I can't do anything. Whoa, hold on. I'm trying to go upwards. There we go. Ooh, get him. Get him. Come on, come on. Wind up. Oh, I was trying to do the wind up punch, but instead we did the headbutt of doom. That was still pretty cool. Good job, Diddy. Diddy's been like right next to us through thick and thin for this entire thing. I like it. Except for the first time where we fought him. We had like a little bit of a disagreement. We went through that super fast. Like I'm sure it'll be more difficult once we do higher level difficulties. I don't know if the uh, classic mode gets longer after that. Like maybe, oh, thank you. So final result, 3.3 intensity, 104,000 points. Very cool. One thing I want to do now though, is I want to, uh... oh, oh yeah, that's right, we have the credits. Which I don't know if you guys want to see me do this every single time. I might do it this time just because I think I like sort of skipped some of it last time. I want to sort of see it through and through. Ah, uh, you know what, maybe not. <laughs> Maybe I will just go ahead and skip it, but we do get prizes for it, so I'll just keep doing it until we get all the prizes. But yeah, DK's a lot of fun. I think that, uh... oh gosh, there we go. And this is one of, the... I think this is the song at the end of uh, Tropical Freeze. But yeah, that was a lot of fun. I feel like at some point I want to play through uh, the original Donkey Kong Country Returns for the Wii. That'll be a lot of fun eventually. I don't know when, but at some point. While I do love the Super Nintendo Donkey Kong games, I don't plan on playing them anytime soon just because they're so difficult. It's crazy how tough those games are. The DK doesn't seem so bad. He definitely seems to be a, like a pretty approachable character, especially maybe for somebody like me who's new to the heavier weight characters. I mean, I don't even remember who I played in Brawl. Like, I, I played that game so minimally, I don't remember who I played at all. Like, I mean, I sort of played the game for the story mode because I thought the cutscenes were cool. And even then, I didn't know much about Nintendo at that point, so it was definitely an interesting experience. <laughs> but yeah, anyways, I've been having a ton of fun with this Smash in particular. It's been really cool. And honestly, I like I, I recorded the first three episodes like in a row, so I didn't see your guys' responses to everything right away. But I was blown away by how many of you enjo are enjoying the series so far. You know, fighting games aren't really my thing, and I didn't think too many people were gonna be interested in me playing it, so. Thank you guys so much for, you know, letting me know you're interested and in that you've been enjoying the series so far. Like, that's really cool to me, because it's not what I was expecting. I was expecting some people to be interested, but not as many as there were, so thank you. Okay, so, okay, we got all the presents, so I'm just gonna go ahead and press start and skip the rest of this, just because I'm sure you don't want to sit through it all. <laughs> oh, that's such a cool little photo. He's like, too many bananas. What do I do with this many? All right, well, we got a million points. We defeated 81 uh, names, I guess, and we had a 1,000 and... 86 hits, cool. So the GameCube controller, let's talk about that. Honestly, it feels pretty natural. I don't feel like it plays any different. Unlock Donkey Kong is a spirit, that's awesome. Let's unlock Alessandro and Zagi, whoever he is. <laughs> but that is pretty cool. I like the GameCube controller a lot. It has been actually pretty fun to play with. And a new foe has appeared, I know who that is. Who's that Pokemon trainer? <laughs> All right, let's try this out. Apparently with every character I unlock, it gets more difficult, so we do have to be very careful about this. Oh gosh, Squirrel, get out of here. <laughs> We're just sort of intimidating each other. Oh, you know what? Yeah, try to do that, that's what happens. Mmm, oh, that was good. Oh, now he's gonna send out Venusaur. Do they all share the same amount of health that were Ivysaur? Sorry, it is weird that it's like the first evolution of, you know, Bulbasaur, second evolution of Ivysaur. Oh, oh, you're stuck in the ground, that was so cool. I love that. Boom, and then I can just, oh, I wanted to wind up my punch there, but I sort of messed it up. I wanna try that again. There we go. Wind up, wind up, wind up, wind up. Punch, oh, it missed, no. <laughs> try it again. I really wanna do that, I really wanna pull that off. Okay, Squirtle, watch it, buddy. No, no, you know what, I wanna have to, I'm gonna have to start doing some drastic moves here. I can't have the cool finish. Mm. Oh, we got him, see ya. So we just unlocked the Pokemon Trainer, how cool is that? Pokemon Trainer joins the battle. Very awesome. But yeah, like I was saying before, 
I'm gonna try to unlock all the characters in, well, I mean, I'll unlock them as often as I can, but I'm gonna be playing um, all the characters in order. So first is gonna be Mario, DK, Link, Samus, Yoshi, Kirby, Fox, Pikachu, Ness, Jigglypuff. I think those that's the order. I'm gonna try to do it that way. That way, you know, if you're like, oh, I really wanna see you play this character, and that's the 53rd character, you'll know what episode I'm gonna do that on, so you don't have to, like, wonder the whole time. Um, and it also makes it easier for me to learn the characters sort of naturally. So before we continue on, I do wanna check out the alternate skins. Every character has a couple of alternate skins, that way if more than one person was playing Donkey Kong, you'd be able to tell. So I don't know how to see them. Oh, here we go. So I didn't check out the Mario ones at all. So I'm gonna do that now, and then we'll check out the Donkey Kong ones. So Mario had uh, the Stars and Stripes Mario, which is pretty cool. He has this like blue and purple, uh, some like black and white, probably like a Mario Land kind of thing. <laughs> sort of looks like Luigi there, a Waluigi one. A Mario Maker one is super cool. And then finally the Mario Odyssey wedding outfit, which is awesome. And then DK, he has like, uh, gray DK, he's a little orange here, a little bit purple, a little bit green, a little bit, he's like, he's white, that's pretty cool. So nothing like particularly reference, like it's not particularly referencing anything with his different skins like Mario's is, with his like his red, white, and blue, his Waluigi, his Mario Maker, these are just different colors, so that's still pretty cool. I don't know what these symbols, add members? What does that mean? Oh, if I wanna play with other players, okay, gotcha. Interesting stuff, so I'm not quite done showcasing DK, of course. I wanted to go ahead and go to training and get a little bit more familiar with his uh, smash ball move. I, I like We almost had the chance to see it in game, but unfortunately I missed out. And since this episode shows short, I might end up going and just trying something else a little bit. Just, you know, 10, 20 minutes of just playing with DK and have a good time with it. So let's fight. Let's see what we can do. Donkey Kong's Origins. Donkey Kong, the arcade classic, was released in 1981. In that game, something, something. Oh, we're going against Sonic for some reason. I thought they were gonna go against the, the thing. The punching bag. I don't know why it puts me against Sonic. Anyways, let's go to our other settings, right? Or no, how do I go to, hold on. Okay, that's just gonna be charging up in the background. Um, items, here we go, this is what I wanted. Smash ball. So I wanna try this out. There we go. Oh, that's so cool. Oh, that's so cool. DK just goes wild. Boom, <laughs> see ya. Oh my gosh, I love it. That's so cool. So what I wanted to try before, but I, I sort of messed up on, is I wanted to, get up Sonic, you can handle it. Boom, knock them into the floor, and, well that's not really what I was looking for, but still a pretty cool move. And then, boom, and then charge up, charge up, charge up. Ah, oh, but he jumps out, so you gotta be able to time that just right. Charge up, charge up, charge up. Ah, oh, that is not easy, but I wanna get used to it now. Boom, that's really cool, I like that. I don't know, this is probably one of the most satisfying things yet. So like that's, like I like that move. This is down and A at the same time. Okay. Cause like if you hold left in A, he does a roll, but if you tap right in A, like there's tap moves and then there's like momentum moves, which is very interesting to me. But for special, it's not like that. It's only like that for the A moves. All right, boom. <laughs> okay, I've had a lot of fun here, but that's all I wanted to try for the training. So, um, yeah, a lot of you did reinforce my idea that it might be best just to you know have episodes focused on classic mode and story mode. But you know, if the classic mode is going to be a little on the short side, I could sizzle in some other game modes. I don't really know what other game modes are available. Like, there's Mob Smash defeating an entire army of enemies. I really don't know if that's what we want to do at the moment. Maybe we could just do a quick round of Smash, which if you don't know what this is, this is basically your normal if you just want to play and fight. And there's a whole bunch of things you could edit that I don't even know the meaning of half of this stuff, so I think we're just going to... Uh, wait, how do I play? Uh, I don't know. Hold on. Um, I don't, I, I'm fine with the rule set. Oh, I had to choose one of those, gotcha. We'll just do, what, what Donkey Kong maps are there? Oh, there was one Donkey Kong map right here. This is the original that we played in the first one. Hmm, let's play a little bit more with this one. I like it. And then I'll play DK, and then maybe the rest of it can be random. That sounds fine with me. Should we have more than one fighter, though? I think we'll, we should have more than one fighter. Uh, can I make it a CPU? There we go. Oh, that's so cool. So we're gonna have a pretty big battle this time. I think it'll just be like a total free for all. That's gonna be awesome. Let's let's get ready to fight. Oh boy. So it's Donkey Kong versus Kirby, Mario, and Fox, and they even have random skins. Interesting. 
All right, are you ready? Boom, this is gonna be fun, <laughs> I hope. I like it, this is really cool. Oh, you know what, one nice detail about this map is they sort of kept the old school textures. If you see in the background, the textures are very low, like low quality, because this is an N64 map. That's a really nice touch, I like that idea. Okay, so everybody who's fighting right now is was originally in the original Smash Bros, how cool is that? Oh, let me get the Kirby. No, that's mine. No, did Kirby steal it? Of course Kirby stole it, he's Kirby. Okay, come on, got him. Now wait. Oh gosh, oh gosh. Oh, I still have the Fire Flower. So I need to do like more grabs, because that's something I haven't been too much doing. Oh gosh, whoa, what was that? There was just like a spark ball. Oh, it's going around the thing. Oh, it's from like Super Mario World. All right, uh, whoa, hold on. This is not good. I'm trying to just be careful, because I have, oh, and we have more than one stock. So you might have noticed that some enemies got taken off there, but they they aren't gone for good, because there's more than one stock. But this is actually a timed battle. So we it's about who survives the longest and the best. Oh, that's cool that you can slam down with it. Oh, I love that kick, too. So that takes a little bit more burst. Oh, no, it's mine, it's mine, it's mine. I need it. No, Mario, don't do it. You're always stealing DK's thunder. Ah, oh, whoa, who got it? It was Fox. Oh, well. That's so cool, I really wanted it. Watch out, watch out, oh gosh. He sends pilots everywhere. Oh, that's so cool, I wanna like close my eyes, I wanna see it for myself. I wanna close my eyes, I don't know if that actually helped or not. Okay, I think we're back in the action. Oh gosh, no, 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 I got knocked out. That's fine though, because everybody else is doing a lot worse than I am, mostly. Um. All right, you know what, Mario, get in the ground. And then I'm gonna, wait, oh, you can like fight out of it, can't you? Okay, so really knocking people into the ground isn't that effective. All right, Fox, you're going in the ground though, because I'm sick of you. And then, ooh, that could have worked out a little bit better. <laughs> there we go, see you, Mario. One thing is that his up special is definitely a lot more controllable than the average up special, so I don't really have too much of an issue using it most of the time. I'm sure I'm, I'm bound to make some silly mistake. Oh, got rid of Mario. Whoa, Kirby, what are you doing with that thing? I don't know, I don't know, but it looks like Mario's defeated. I'm down to my last stock, which means I need to get Kirby out of here right now. Oh, oh, there we go, oh, that was beautiful. Oh, that was so cool. Sudden death between me and Kirby because we were both tied at 0% health. Oh, oh, ho, 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 see you, Kirby. That was so cool. Oh my gosh. I think Donkey Kong is pretty cool. DK. Okay, so we got him. How awesome is that? We earned some gold for that, of course. Uh, I got the most KOs. I also followed, fell the same amount as most of the people. I don't know what SD stands for. Self-defeat, maybe? Maybe Star Fox fell off the stage or something? Really fun, I like it. Uh, dam I gave the most damage. I also, I didn't. I received the least damage. I was just a pro. <laughs> I don't know what difficulty they were at. I don't know if it says anywhere. Okay. Um, we're ready for the next battle, but I'm, I'm finished. <gasps> Whoa, we got another foe appearing, a new challenger. Is this? Yeah, it's Zelda. Oh, cool. This is so awesome. Okay. So let me go ahead and try to beat you up a little bit. I was hoping I can unlock Luigi soon. I don't know. I mean, if we play the story mode, we can also get more characters unlocked that way. I mean, I actually have to beat you up though first. Ooh, that was good. See, that's what I've been looking for. I actually, I love DK so far. Like, I didn't, I thought that maybe I was gonna be like, okay with him. Like, I'm not as in like, okay, playing okay, but like, okay with the fact of how he plays. Because I, I just, it's not really my thing. Or like, heavier characters in any kind of game, really. Like, even like stuff like Mario Kart and stuff, I'd much prefer lighter, more dexterous characters. Whenever I have the choice, that's usually what I go for. But honestly, I enjoy DK so far. He seems to have a well mix, even though he's a big, big bulky character. She's kicking my butt right now, by the way. I need to focus on this. Gotcha, ooh, 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 okay, we're trapped down here. This is not good, this map is really scary. I remember this one from Brawl, actually. Mm. Okay, that was good. Ooh, not bad, not bad. Oh, I was trying to beat her up with that. Gotta be careful. Mm. Come on, come on, yes! We got her, so Zelda is unlocked. Good job, DK. Zelda joins the battle. She looks so cool in this game. I like it. So that was a ton of fun. We were able to play through classic mode with DK without too much of an issue, and also be able to win a game of just normal Smash with it as well. Maybe we'll try some of these other game modes soon enough, like Squad Strike, or Tourney, or Special Smash. I don't know what any of those really are. A lot of people were saying they don't like the online mode too much for this game. I really don't know what that's about. 
I haven't played it before, but I think that that's probably where I'm gonna leave it off for today. Maybe next episode we'll go online and play with a character. Not next episode, but you know what I mean. Let's take a look at it now, smash tags. Your smash tag is, a, is your identity when playing online. When creating your tag, you can customize it with an icon and a color. If you KO another player online and place higher than them in the battle results, you'll claim their tag as a trophy. Assign messages to the directional buttons to chat with other players before and after battle. Oh, I forgot to use DK's taunt, so I wanna check that out real fast. Uh, so we're gonna, wait. I don't wanna do this now. Can I do this later? Ah, okay, I'll, I'll do this for now. You know what? Oh, we can choose so many different things. I don't know which one we should choose. Hopefully I can change this later, right? Ooh, what should I choose? There's too many options. <laughs> now I've gotten really distracted. Uh, oh, I wanna do Mr. Game & Watch, but I also wanna do something else. <laughs> the, the Wii Fit Board. There's too many options. Uh, hmm. I don't even know. There's like too many Nintendo characters to choose from for me to say my favorite. I think we're gonna go with, uh, out of everything? Ooh, it's hard to say. We gotta go Lemmy, we're gonna go Lemmy. That's just what I gotta do. Color, can we make it black? No, black. Yeah, black and white, there we go, I like it. I'm gonna save this for now, and then maybe we can go back to that and tweak it later. But for right now, there's one last thing I forgot to do, and it's I gotta check out DK's taunts. Every character needs their taunt showcased, so we're doing that right now. But yeah, I've had a ton of fun with this guy. He's great. There we go. And then, yeah, once again, a positive rating for me for the the, the GameCube controller. I, I think it's pretty cool. But let's see. Okay, he you know does his normal Donkey Kong thing. He shakes, shaking around. And then he also has, oh, that's my favorite. Ooh. <laughs> all right, awesome stuff. So hopefully I'll remember to do all that kind of stuff a little bit more sequentially in the next character showcase, which won't be next episode, but the episode after that. So stay tuned for that. I think we'll be checking out Link or Samus. I think it's Link. So that'll be a ton of fun. Let me know your thoughts on Donkey Kong as a playable Smash character. And of course, the GameCube controller. I would love to hear all about it. And stay tuned. Next episode, we'll be going back into the World of Light story mode. And that is bound to be a ton of fun. But for now, thank you guys so much for watching today's episode of Super Smash Brothers Ultimate. If you watched this part of the video, make sure you comment Zebra Kong so now you've watched at the end of the you are a Zebra Tastic viewer. Check out more episodes like this one on your screen right now or by subscribing to join the Zebra Herd. On the way, thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you next time, bye bye.